What's up and welcome to episode Gizmo Slip. Today we have the Galaxy Note 10. This is the Aura Glow. It's insanely beautiful. Like the, the, the finish on this is unlike anything I've ever seen on any smartphone. One nice thing that Samsung has done this time around is they've included a plastic screen protector all the way around on the front. That should help with the face down drop, I, I think. Maybe, we'll find out, right? That's one really interesting question. And then the back, uh, I, I think it's just gonna shatter, but you never know. I'm really curious. The back is this like chrome orangish looking color. And then if you get it in the right light, you can get some really insane looking colors coming out of it. It's just super cool looking. The goal of this drop test is to drop it 10 times from all the different potential angles. If the Galaxy Note 10 shatters, we're gonna go ahead and smash the crap out of it. Cause I, I really wanna see what it looks like when you shatter the back. It's gonna be freaking awesome. Let's get started. All right, we're gonna start off with the bottom left corner drop test in three, two, one. Woo! All right. Well, the display didn't shatter. Look at this plastic screen protector already starting to take damage. It's already ripped a little bit right here. This screen protector is not designed to last very long, but we'll leave it on there the whole drop test and see if it makes a difference. In three, two, one. <laughs> the stylus shot out of the phone. Looks like it's okay. Did the phone survive? Yes. Okay, so you can see that the screen protector is still taking more damage. I mean, I'm glad the glass didn't break, but that's a lot of damage. In three, two, one. Woo, that turned into a lot more of a face drop than anticipated. Oh boy. Did we shatter the front already? Yep, we did. Well, you really can't trust that front screen protector very well. That drop essentially turned into a face down drop test. Let's take a look at that slow motion replay and see exactly what happened. Okay, here comes the Note 9. It's hitting in the bottom right corner first and then flips down, slams the top right corner into the ground and you can see it's shattered in several points. And I mean, holy crap, you can easily tell that that plastic screen protector did not do hardly anything. One thing I wanna point out is that this is actually really smooth. You can't feel these cracks at all, which actually makes this Note 10 still pretty usable, and that's just because of that plastic screen protector. We're gonna go ahead and see how durable the back glass is. My hopes are not high. I, I thought we had something with this front screen protector being built into the Note 10, but that, is clearly not enough to protect the glass at all from a direct impact. You're gonna want a better, thicker screen protector that's gonna absorb those impacts. I'll have a link to some cases down below if you're interested in picking one up for your Note 10. Okay, it's time to find out how durable this Aura Glow glass back is. Here we go. Three, two, one. Whew. Okay. Dun, dun, dun! What? No way, it survived. That is insane, I can't believe that it didn't shatter on the direct impact on the back. Let's go ahead and take a look at the slow motion replay and see what happened. All right, here comes the Note 10. You can see it hits on one side, flops, bounces around the corners, and whoa, the stylus actually popped out, and then somehow the stylus goes back in because the stylus was not popped when we initially picked the phone up. Look at this, the stylus goes right back in and it goes chunk and it connects back inside. <laughs> what? So it survived that impact ricocheting around the edges of the back. I'm curious if we can't get a more direct impact on the back glass. Three, two, one. Feeling pretty good about that drop test. Let's see, what? What? Look at this, you can even see where on the back glass it took the impact and it didn't shatter. Okay, all right Samsung, this is impressive stuff. Why didn't you do the same glass on the freaking front, huh? We're gonna try dropping it on the back again and see what happens. In three, two, one.
That seemed to be another pretty good drop on the back. And we finally cracked it. It took three consecutive hits on the back to be able to shatter it, but we finally have done it. Uh, interestingly enough, not shattered anywhere except the very corner glass above the, the camera, which is kind of impressive. I honestly thought we would have shattered the back much worse by now after three big drops directly on the glass. Okay, that's insane. Look at how pretty that thing is. Just need to keep shattering it. It's gonna get better and better. Here we go, shattering the back one more time in three, two, one. Oh, dang. Oh, look at that. That's insane. Oh God. It just keeps getting cooler and cooler to look at. Like I could have a 10 minute video just looking at this phone. <laughs> <laughs> That's the truth though. This is like oddly satisfying for sure. Oh, this back is so cool. The front screen is also weirdly colored and awesome looking. Wow, we freaking destroyed this Note 10. It's amazing. Watch my videos, subscribe, peace out. <laughs> That's done. <laughs> like, what the hell's with that ending? <laughs> you get so many people commenting, what?